Hey, welcome to another episode of Dishonored. It been way too long. Forgot how to play. Okay. So, what do we need to do exactly? Where's my objective? Let's just get out of here, or try to at least. Oh, probably the blue door that's right here. I can hide here for as long as it takes. Seems that no one is safe when a man is that close to a prize like the throne. We even make it to tonight. Will you look at this mess? Relax. One of the officers said he was dead. Poison thrown in the river. If you ask me, he's long gone. Through the mask in the river, left him. That's what a rational person would do. Not this guy. You have to understand the criminal mind. I hear they had to hide the Caldwin girl from him the whole time they were working with him. I heard they locked him in a cage and only let him out at night. The criminal mind, huh? So what's he doing now? Waiting. He's probably watching us right now. With that crazy mask on, creeping closer and closer, ever closer, until... Cut it out. What's so impressive about Corvo, anyway? Who's he got up against? A couple of high overseers, a couple of noblemen? He could never stand up to men with our training. Well, now I do hope he shows up. I want to see you run crying for the cover of the tall boys out back. Like you were, the other night. What was I supposed to do, stand there and get hit by rocks? They were just kids. They were a gang. I hope Lord Regent Havelock sends the tall boys in to level the place. It's gonna be a new era. Having a ten-year-old on the throne isn't gonna cure the plague. High Overseer Martin says it will. He says we were cursed when the Empress died by Corvo's black magic. And the rats are never gonna leave until we had a real Caldwin back. He says the outsider fuss has been warped. There's some curse on this. Update. Our men are still trying to penetrate the workshop. Those are the ton of I think Piero Joplin's inside. Crackpot, natural philosopher. There is evidence that Anton Sokolov was held here against his will for some time. We can't determine what happened to him. I'll bet my commission he's in that building with Piero Joplin. If so, arrest him. But I don't want him harmed until I get to the bottom of all this. <coughs> Careful. The place may be booby-trapped and I want him alive. What else? Yes, sir. The servants were all executed shortly before we arrived. Looks like a... Hold on, I'm gonna have to save because I'm gonna have to make a swift maneuver. Able cutlass and a small bore pistol. Looks like Corvo ran amok before he left. Turn this building inside out, and it goes without saying. This area is sealed. Stealth walkers at all points. And stay vigilant. Corvo's the most dangerous man in the Empire now, and he has nowhere else to go. <clears throat> Never thought he'd bother us again. I guess he holds a grudge. Oh gosh, I'm going to have to read this. Um, Havelock's order to the guard. Cap um, Captain Manning. Uh, that's a morning captain. Captain Manning, we've tracked the conspiracy to the Hound's Pit pub. Search our premises for the natural philosophers Pierre Joplin and Anton Sokolov. Do what you must to secure materials related to the enhanced arc pylon they have been constructing. Question them thoroughly, and once you are certain you have everything they know of the pylon, execute them both. Bring the pylon to me, along with his papers and recordings. They may be, they may be two of the greatest minds of our age, but they also, tra they're also traitors who can conspire with Corvo to bring down this empire. I'm keeping Emily, I'm keeping Empress Emily Caldwin with me at the lighthouse on Kingsborough Island until we're certain that Corvo and his fellow conspir conspirators have been properly dealt with. Lord Regent Hadlock. Oops. City get any worse? Indeed, I believe so. Ah.
Okay. I had to get out of there for a second. You got an Emily. Or... Now, Emily's on an island somewhere. Hmm. Oh gosh. Uh, remember before when I mentioned a special drawing I was working on for you? This is a. I don't know where you. I don't know where you went, but I hope you. I, but I hope when you get back, you see this and like it. I'd like to take it to Dunwall Tower with us. Everyone's acting strange tonight. Samuel was whispering to Alista about a flare launcher that she was supposed to use to call him told her to lock the door and to, to lock the door to my old tower I heard the Admiral tell the others we are leaving tonight for a place called the lighthouse in, on Kingsborough Island I'd be get back before then Emily Corvo I can't believe you're alive they killed everyone, Corvo. They killed everyone to cover it all up. Then they took Emily with them and they left. I couldn't do anything to protect her. Please find her. Make her safe. All his talk. Callista Fret and I, I believe there is still hope for Emily and Dunwall. Uh, I don't believe Corvo is gone. I'll be searching the river for him. But if you catch wind of him, shoot a flare using the launcher. I place an Emily's tower, and I'll make my way back as quickly as I can. Keep this tower locked and take care of yourself. Emily is going to need you when this is over, Samuel. Being an honorable military man, but Havelock will use Emily like a puppet to his own advantage. Something changed in the Admiral as soon as the Lord Regent died. It had been building up. Martin was acting strange, going quiet if any of us were near, whispering late into the night with Havelock and Pendleton while you were out doing the real work. I think they realized they were one step away from holding the same position the Lord Regent had. And worried they'd be held accountable for what they did here, the as the Loyalists. <laughs> they would have killed me too, but Havelock spared me. Out of respect for my uncle, I believe. Please, talk to Samuel and the others. Someone must know where they're going. Find Emily. She's suffered through so much, and she's got no one else on her side except you. Samuel set this here in case you returned. You can use it to call him. He said he'd come quickly. Hopefully there's a place he can dock where the watch won't see him. The city watch is everywhere out there. But I don't even care if they find me anymore. I saw Samuel on the river earlier. I'm sure he'll take you to Emily. One last trip, I expect. All right. There he is. I'd find you here. It never pays to bet against you, does it? I saw the signal. I knew you'd be back, Corvo. I knew it. We'll need to get out of here soon. The Admiral controls the military now, Martin's high overseer, and Pendleton's in favor with the aristocracy and Parliament. They need Emily, of course. But if Havelock senses that it's all about to fall down around him, who knows what he's liable to do? Okay. Good. Let's go. There's one more trip across the river to where it meets the sea. That's where the Lord Regent was building his new lighthouse. Ought to be something to see. Achieving a lock, Spectre. Overall chaos low. Thank goodness. Uh, yeah. Cool. Gotta get that low chaos.
This is it, sir. I suspect Havelock Martin and Lord Pendleton landed there a while ago and went into the lighthouse. Knowing them, they're not giving up without a fight. I remember hearing the Admiral and Martin talking about this place as where they'd hold up if they had to. Anybody going in has to breach the fort and the gatehouse, and then there's only one way to the top. All I can say is that it's been a pleasure serving with you. <clears throat> Maybe after all this is settled, we'll see each other again. Hopefully so. Good luck, Corvo. If anyone deserves it, you do. Give my best to Emily. The last time. On the throne. Area map. Okay. <laughs> you are here. Won't have time for an old man like me. I knew you were sharp, Corvo, but somehow you managed to get through all this mess. Oh, okay. I didn't mean to cut him off. Not where I need it. That's nice to have. Holy cow, this game is loud.
Okay. I was really hoping that guy had the lighthouse key instead of being like in the beginning of the map or something. You guys can't tell because this is going to be edited. I've been working on just going to this part for a long time. There is way too many guards. It is stressful. Talents wasted until he found his fate. Callista, the nursemaid. Bitter Piero, ejected from the academy. Samuel, a useless old man, hungry for purpose. <laughs> Yes, yes you will. Okay, thank goodness overall chaos is low. Ghost never detected. Huh, really? We got a... I'll take it. <laughs> Whatever. I will take that. Alright, this is gonna be the end. I'm, of course, it's not like the end, the end, but it will be here just a minute. So ends the oh, never mind. It is, it is the end. Never now, mind. Emily called when the first will take her mother's throne after a season of turmoil. You will stand at her side, Corvo, guiding her young mind 
and protecting her from those who seek to exploit her or cause her harm. You watched and listened when other men would have shouted in rage. You held back instead of striking. So it is, with the passing of the plague and Emily's ascension, comes a golden age brought about by your hand. And decades hence, when your hair turns white and you pass from this world, Empress Emily, Emily the Wise, at the height of her power, will lay your body down within her mother's great tomb, because you are more to her than royal protector. Farewell, Corvo. Alone or for all of the big and the small, will the taller they stand, will the harder they fall. We live for today, but we die for the next. With blood in our veins, in the air, in our chest, do we step into war with our hearts on the line? The dirt on our boots is six free over time. A distant aroma at best A withering smile that's stuck deep in your vest The night air it wraps its fingers around Your body it shakes from a now distant sound Oh, the sound of her voice A sweet symphony Played over and over until you are free
All right. Yeah. That's the end of Dishonored. No more episodes. I'm glad to be done with this game uh, because I have more games to uh, show off. So I only got this game out the way. Um, yeah, I would have been done with this if I had been better about rec recording, recording episodes and then editing them, but just, I don't want to edit. <laughs> but um, yeah, that's the end of Dishonored 1. I hope you enjoyed this series. Um, and I will see you in another video of whatever game I'm going to play next. So, yeah, bye.